for years and years, I would get surveys from hotels and I would fill out these surveys, send them in, and nothing would happen. I might complain about the air conditioning in a particular room, the lamp somewhere. Um, at one point, I had a real issue with a hotel. Sent the, the survey in, nothing. After a while, you kind of learn that your feedback doesn't really matter, and you stop responding. I don't know about you, but that's the way I feel. In a net promoter system, we don't do that. We close the loop between the company and the customer. The customer raises an issue that requires some sort of response, either because it's a promoter who has really thoughtful, constructive feedback, or a detractor who has some sort of unresolved issue. Someone gets in touch with that customer very quickly after they provided the feedback. They get an understanding of what was really going on for that customer. They listen empathetically. They dig down and understand more of the detail around it. They give the customer opportunities to say more. And in the event that there's something specific that can be done to improve that customer's situation, they take action. That's closing the loop between the company and the customer. The other thing that they do is they close the loop between the customer and the employee. Closed loop feedback involves employees having experiences with customers and then very quickly getting the feedback from those specific customers while they can still remember the interaction they had so that they can learn and grow and improve in their job. So what do the best companies do? First, they contact customers within 24 hours of getting feedback. They share the feedback with their own employees very quickly and individually in a granular way. And they use that feedback to improve processes and products and support their employees and their customers. Doing all of that is actually a big job. It's not typically something that you can just flip a switch on. So it requires IT systems, it requires processes, it requires measurement and follow-up. But at the end of the day, the whole purpose of soliciting feedback from a customer is to learn what they need and take action on that. And unless you close the loop, you won't learn and you won't improve the relationship you have with that customer.